Cleveland in 2006 who were at beautiful Bush Stadium in San Frank Tanana, a Michigan born lefty, gets the starting job here. Dan, any thoughts? Boy, this guy was unbelievably good in this last one. Struck out a ton of guys in an amazing performance. And all Atlanta. of his pitches were the working. Let's hope he brings that A game back with him in this one. First pick, 760. Good fastball down around the knees there, taken no for a strike. And a good pitch there as this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. Didn't mess around much in that at bat, Dan. No, that was pretty impressive, right man. I really like a pitcher that trusts and works Ready. off his fastball. Going right one. there, he decided he didn't need to use anything else. Three straight heaters and go Gretz bench. And fellas, we take a look at the Redbirds entering play here tonight. They come in unbeaten and playing well here in the early going. Maddie, this is the best team in baseball right now. I have mean, just a double digit winning streak that I mean maybe happens to two or three teams a year you get this hot this team is rocking in all facets right now and they're a fun watch so here is Ronald Acuna currently ninth in the NL in hitting entering play and a long run but he's there to Bryce Wilson a right hander from North Carolina is the man on the mound what do we need to know here Danny well one thing to look out for him Matt is if he Move. can avoid the big and it's belted high and deep into right center and goodbye this one ain't coming back baseball has really changed remember when leadoff guys were guys that would just draw walks and steal bases that but that's not the no, case anymore four. guys like this Number they have pop in their bat and they can go deep a bouncer to the left side on the first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. Next that to is hit good. is Yadier Molina. What a season Yadier. he's having. Entering play, oh, leading the league high. in two of the three triple crown categories. Hit in the air to center field. Acuna giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. And now that in the cool. box, Albert Pujols. The second First at bat Albert for him Burke. as he enters play number three Ooh, in the boy. National League batting race. Hey, not a bad year for a second baseman. There's some really good two sackers out there, but second. There's a swing and a ball hit in the air and a ball that he got every stitch of as that one, without a doubt, is gone. home run is definitely worth giving the show track treatment to and as we look at it not only an impressive distance shot but the 110 miles an hour exit velocity is nothing to scoff at either that's a big boy home run now into the box Dylan Carlson batting first three. shot for him here right as here. he enters play currently yeah. leading the senior circuit in oh, batting God. what a season this guy's having he's right up there among the RBI leaders and he's awfully dangerous with runners on base there's a drive out to left center field. Around first, he's digging for second. And he will pull into second with a two out double. That is good. Not shortstop. Ozzie. So yeah. now to the plate, Ozzie Smith, as he hits one on a line to left field. Ozuna gets there for the catch, and that ends the inning. Second inning set to go, and next to bat will be the first baseman, Freddie Freeman, as the fastball is swung on and missed. Good location down at the knees for strike one. Hey, when you're featuring a mid 90s fastball like this pitcher, attack with that pitch. Get ahead, get the offense on their toes. That opens up the off speed pitches later in the game. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. Ready now is Austin Riley. He's looking to get things going at the plate. It has not been going his way of late. Throw gets him, two down. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Just got a piece to the right side. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. You know that nasty changeups lurking right here. If I'm in the batter's box, I have to tell myself to stay back. But we'll have to press pause. Is that strike three to retire the side?
Fourth state I'm interested to see how the focused their team. ABs will be Matt. playing with this lead. Carpenter. I think this needs to be a little bit of a smell blood inning. Keep the fire rolling. I know it's early, but keep the pressure going. Swinging the bat's nice. And there's one down now. Batting it. Next, it'll be Jim Edmonds. Jim Edmonds. First pitch coming. Here it is. Into center field, line drive, base hit. Don't sleep on the bottom of the order right there. He broke out all ambushed. Batting nuts. First pitch, no fastball, middle in. He's what? able to drive that for a nice. nice. Into the box, Frank Tanana. And he puts it on the ground to second. There's one. Relay to Freddie. Double play, and that'll end the. The batter will be William Contreras. He's the number seven hitter, but he's leading off the third after the first six guys in the lineup have been retired in order. Yeah, it's been a great start to the guy on the mound. It'll be interesting to see if they can find a way to get to this guy before he really settles in. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Fastball called strike three and there's the first out of the inning. Ready to deliver here comes the first pitch. Good swing just got to try and straighten that one out. Into the windup here comes the 0 and 1. Hard hit ball to second. Scooped up. Throw gets him. Two down. Batting on. And pitcher. now pitch on the way. Number 46. Bryce Wilson is at the plate now and he's quickly behind 0-1. Okay, if you're in this lineup right here, game on, boys. I know he's got power stuff, but if he, he's going to come middle of the plate, you better be ready to pull the trigger. Swing and a miss at a big breaking ball, and that's how the inning comes to an end. Bottom of the inning now, and next will be a speed thread in the form of outfielder Lou Brock. He turned around that fastball and drove it out of the park in his previous at bat, so there's got to be a good chance they mix it up right here on him and try and go off speed. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Well, back in the day, you would hope your leadoff man could work a walk or leg out an infield single, but not in today's game. Now they expect the leadoff hitter to have a little pop, just like this guy. Nice leadoff double. Hit on the ground toward the left, and there's a base hit as that gets through into left. They'll get it in quickly to the second baseman, so it's runners at the corners now with nobody out. Now at the plate, here is Yadier Molina, and they're runners at the corners now. He's set and the pitch. And there's a base hit on the line. And that'll bring home run number three. It's now a 3 nothing cushion. No batter, number five. Second baseman, Albert. To the plate now, Albert Pujols. That's a strike to throw down. Not in time. He's safe at third as they pull off the double steal. You know, I was pretty surprised to see him on the move to third because it didn't seem like he had that much of a lead, but he made it work out. That was really impressive. Swanson scoops it up. Throw to first is in time, but meanwhile, the runner is in to score. No Into right the box, Dylan Carlson. He Get doubled away. his last time up. Carlson. Ready to deal. Here comes the first pitch. Line drive to center field. Catch made in straightaway center as the runner tags from second. Now, now to the plate that. here is Ozzie Smith. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah. Has a look. Now the pitch. Slapped hard the opposite way. Base hit and that'll get a run in. The third baseman number 16. Matt Carpenter. Here's Matt Carpenter. Swing and a ball hard hit toward deep right. Heredia finds some space out there for the catch to retire. 
So up steps Ozzy Albies back to the top of the lineup as they're still looking for their first base runner in this one. No doubt about that, Matt. They've yet to figure this guy out on the mound. He's looked great so far. He has, but we'll see if this second trip through the order changes anything. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what kind of adjustments these hitters are able to make in the middle innings of this game. Right down Main Street caught him looking. Now first offering on its right way. Guillermo. Guillermo Heredia is in with Guillermo one away now as he swings and misses here at strike one. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating, feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. To the left side, but it's well foul. You can really tell they're trying to keep the ball in on this big slugger right here. Is that an effort to keep him from getting extended, do you think? Yeah, I think that's the idea, Matt. But he might spin the win if he starts looking for it in there. Into the corner and slicing foul. The next 0-2. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. Ready to go. And Four here comes fluid. the first baseman, the Jim first Edmonds. Baseman, Jim. Now here's the pitch. Edmonds. Hit hard towards center. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. So that leadoff base hit means considerable speed aboard to start out the inning. The pitcher, number 40. Hey, they've obviously what? locked in on something Good here. Hannah. They know this pitcher likes to get ahead, and they've done nothing but be aggressive early in the count. There's another leadoff single to get him going. He's 0 for 1 thus far. A swing and a ground ball to third. A dive, but he can't make the play, and it's down the left field line. Onto the shortstop, but thrown away. And the ball's back in quickly, so it'll be second and third now with nobody oh, out. Tyler Matzek answers the call from the pen here in the fourth as they didn't get the outing they were hoping for from the starter. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Lou Brock. He hits here in a spot where he might be able to put this one out of reach. Tanana rounds the corner and is headed home. Safe at the plate as the lead swells to 7 0. Boy, this guy's having a great a game here so far, D. Rowe. Home run earlier in the night, and that base hit right there drives in his third run that in of this game. Yeah, you drive to the park every day hoping your rhythm and timing is on point with that pitcher's windup. And that's exactly been the case today. He not only mixed in that big bomb, but now he's got three ribbies to boot. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Some guys just lay back and watch that four. first pitch go by, no matter yeah, what. Yeah. Work the count, make the pitch no, a waste a few not. pitches, but when he serves up a fastball like this on the first pitch. Swung on and hit pretty well out to deep left field. Out of here, into the visitor's bullpen. Well, d -Row, you know they say records are made to be broken. And what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Most RBIs in one season. I can't begin to tell you as a former offensive player what that means. You want to put biscuits in the basket, run scored in ribbies, run scored in ribbies, and this guy's the best in the business right now. The right fielder, number three, Dylan Carlson. Into the box now, Dylan Carlson, as he will swing at the first pitch and line this one into left center, and that's going to get down for extra bases. And they'll keep it going here as he's in with a double. This guy just feasts on the stakes up the of the batter. zone, and, and that's exactly Short what stop. he gets right here. Ozzie. A belt high pitch, he drives into the alley. Yeah. Great chance now with two runners in scoring position. At the plate now, Ozzy Smith. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. 
And the second runner will stop at third, and they're at the corners now with nobody out. Luke 16. Jackson gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Digging in now will be Matt Carpenter as he rips it on the ground to second. And that is through into center field, a base hit. And the runner scores from third as they extend their lead. And he is in there. Man, the hit parade continues. It's not an easy now thing to do in professional baseball. Baseman. Doesn't seem like yeah. this inning's going to ever stop. Edmund. Right now, they've already scored seven runs. At the plate, Jim Edmonds. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. The relay throw. And the throw comes into third, but it's not in time, and it'll be scored a sack Double fly pitcher. and Double an RBI. Point. So here now is the pitcher, Frank Tanana, a hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. He's set, here it comes. Lifted into the air out towards center field. After it is Acuna, he makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. Now it's cut off, a throw to the plate, and he will get in to score, and it's a run batted in on the sacrifice fly. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Lou Brock. He singled and drove home two his last time. A long inning as they've hung a nine spot on him to this point. Swing and a liner. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Boy, talk about having a day, Debro. He gets his now fourth and knock of the game, but mixed in with one of those four was a round tripper. Not a bad day. Yeah, you have five, maybe a, a handful of games that you can throw out four knocks throughout the course of the year. Add in a tater to go with it. He's smiling. His food's going to taste better tonight. So now to the plate, Eric Davis. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Acuna on the move. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Welcome back to Bush Stadium as we send it down to Heidi. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. And a swing from him yields a foul pop out of play to the right. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Jeez, finally. That's the first ball they've taken all night. Do it again, I dare you. Struck him out, and he becomes the ninth strikeout victim thus far. He's just ringing up strikeouts left and right, but what's really impressive to me, he hasn't walked anyone either. He's just pounding the zone. His stuff is dirty today. Austin Riley stands in as he swings and misses for strike one. Curveball taken for a strike on the inside. His command has been outstanding so far, hitting nearly all of his spots, and that's been a big factor why he's been so successful up to this point. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Ready to deliver, here comes the first pitch. High and deep down the left field line, and that will end up a foul ball. He got the fastball where he wanted and just pulled off of it. That's in there, and he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. Hey, offense needs to check itself. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will... Welcome back for the bottom of the fifth. Here's Heidi Watney. So stepping in is Yadier Molina. He went deep to the tune of a three-run job his last time up. Fly ball out toward left center field. Ozuna is going to have room, however, as he makes the catch in deep left center field for the first down. Up next to the target. Next will be the cleanup the hitter, baseman. Albert Pujols. Albert. He homered earlier and is two for three Ooh, to this hole. point. Toward the gap in right center, this is going to be a base hit, and he may take that big turn at first. He'll get it into second. Now batting. Next right here field. is Dylan Carlson Dylan. and he's the reigning recipient oh, of the National League's Player of the Month award. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Line drive and that's a base hit into center field. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. They are putting in some work at the plate in this one Matt. Another great A.B. Another hit. That's another nail in the coffin. Ozzie. That's a startling 15 runs yeah. in this one. And they're still going. 
Stepping in now, Ozzie Smith over to Albies. Relay to Freddie, double play, and that'll end the inning. Top half of the sixth about to get started. And next to hit is the catcher, William Contreras. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. Hey, the guy on the mound is absolutely pounding his zone, and that's why he's been able to stay and pitch deep into this game. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. Stone cold take right there. That fastball very well could have sent him packing back to the bench. And he struck him out. And there's strikeout number 11 in the ball game. Now back. First pitch of the AB now. More so. Strike one to start the at bat. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 and 1. Out in front there as this one's pulled off to the left side. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. Uh, and he's just rolling right now and even dozen strikeouts for him in the ball game. Two up, Your two down on strikes in this inning. Pinch he looks really great. sharp out there, guys. Ender Inciarte will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. As he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty, it's strike one. He's getting a lot of first pitch outs, and it's really easy to see why. He's been perfect. 100% of this. And we'll just leave it there as they make the play to end. AJ Minter gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Now the first pitch. He swings and sends it in the air out to left center. Ozuna is under it. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Next up, Jim Edmonds. A couple baseman. of singles to his credit Jim thus far. Edmonds. Here's the first pitch. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. The 0 1 pitch. Swing and a looper to left. In there, a base hit. This guy came into today absolutely on fire, and no nothing Number has 40. changed. He looks seriously hitterish at the Good dish right God. now. That's his third knock of the game. Standing in now, Frank Tanana. And he'll promptly send it in the air out to center field. Acuna is there, two gone. Now at the plate, Lou Brock no left singled field. in his last at bat. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch as he rips it on the ground to second. That's through for a base hit, and he's putting together a monster line in this one. They just can't get him out. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. Number 44. Boy, and they have not been able to get him out. This is now a five-hit ball game for him here, and those don't come along every day. And that's through and to left, a base hit. And the second run will score as well. Man, I think I've run out of superlatives to talk about their offensive production in this one. That gets Some teams four. don't score 17 runs Yikes. in a four-game set, let alone oh, in yeah. one game here. It's been incredible. To the plate now, Yadier Molina. And he's first pitch swinging here as he lines this one into left field for a base hit. You think he's not setting the tone for this series right there? No Third bad. knock Number of the five. night, and we're only Second in game man. one. This could be Al huge. At the plate now, Albert Pujols Good. pitches a cold strike. The throw is not close as he's in there with a stolen base. He's ready. Here's the 0 1. Swing and a liner. But this will get foul for strike two. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. Pulled high in the air out to left field. And he'll pull this one down a step or two in front of the warning track. And Stepping in for the Braves, Ozzie Albies. He went down on strikes in his last at-bat. Standing in from the right side as he takes strike one. 
Hey, it's really hard to pitch a gem. And what helps? This guy's first pitch strike percentage, how about 100%? Can't get any better than that. A ball and two strikes now. Even though we're late into this ball game, this guy's velo is still top notch. This guy's a horse. And he strikes him out here. So that's out number one here in the seventh as he continues to keep him out of the hit column. Now battle. What's your take on all the strikeouts we see in the game today, Dan? That was his third tonight, and it seems we're seeing that a lot more these days. Yeah, Matt, there's been a real change in philosophy as far as hitting in baseball today. A lot of guys think now that an out is an out, a strikeout is just as good as a regular out, but we're seeing strikeouts at an Hit high and deep out to left field. A leap, but he can't bring it back into the park. It's a home run. So next up will be Freddie Freeman. What a great feeling right there as he circles the pillows. Finally able to get this offense potentially going with one swing of the bat. Being shut out all game, but not anymore. Behind 0-2 now. Still no balls and two strikes. Here comes another 0-2. And he's going to add to the total 14 punch outs now as that ends the inning. It's time for the traditional. But the Braves are able to get one back. Last half of the seventh here. And coming Leading forward is the, the switch hitting team. outfielder, Dylan right Carlson. Dylan. From the stretch. Carlson. A shot to second base and handled for the first out. The batter, number one. Next to hit, Ozzy Smith. Ozzie. He was a double play victim last time around. Yeah, yeah rolling into a two ball will eat at you for the rest of the game at least. So you know he wants to make up for it right here. And a base hit as that's in the left, and they've got themselves a base runner. Now back, the third baseman, Matt Carpenter. At the plate, Matt Carpenter. Down the first baseline. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0 and 1. From the stretch. Uh, not fooled there as this ball's hammered out to deep right field. Gone! And with one swing at a bat, he shows you why he's dripping with tools. He's got the speed. He's got the power. You don't know how to attack this guy. You can't put him on base with a knock or a walk, or he'll just end up on second or third. And if you leave something over the heart of the plate, that's what can happen. As he connects on the first pitch with a fly ball to center, and that'll get down for a base hit. There's a saying amongst the offense, Dan, anybody can get three hits in a big game. It's that fourth one that separates you. We'll talk about that, but he's having a good week in one night. Can you imagine four hits in one game? I'd say he's having a pretty good day. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Swanson picks it up. Step on the bag for one. And nearly a double play. That was closer than I thought it would be, and the inning will continue. Number 20. Lou. Making his way to the plate Brock. once again, Lou Brock. And he needs just a triple for the cycle, so let's see if he can put one in the gap. Back up the middle, and that's through for a hit. There's a hard hit ground ball. Pitcher not able to get a glove on it. Hard yeah, single up the middle. Number yeah, watch your lips right there, Dan. Sent it back right where it came from. In now, Eric Davis. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll hit off the wall in left center. And not in time as the run scores. Well, they don't get much bigger than that the one right there. Four. He's now tied the yeah, single yeah. season base hit record. Oh, oh, man, what an amazing year he's had so far. One more base hit, and he'll have an unprecedented season. Stay tuned, everybody, because it's about to get crazy. Stepping in now, Yadier Molina. He swings and grounds it to short. Swanson brings it in. Throw on to first, and they're able to escape them. Now with the plate is Austin Riley. We're in the eighth now, and nothing's changed out there on the mound. Nah, they just haven't had much of an answer, Matty. They've been off balance and baffled all game. He's got a nice, comfortable lead. You have to think he's going to pound the strike zone. But here, get aggressive. Brock is there, and he'll bring this one in. Oh, 
One away for the Braves here in inning number eight. And that brings up the former number one overall pick, Dansby Swanson. In there, 0 and 1. Swinging strike, and now it's 0 and 2. Woo, not a spot you expect a curveball. He's lucky he missed because that's the kind of pitch that gets hit out of the ballpark. And that'll get on through into center, and he's got himself a one out hit. Hey, they say in this game you better have a short memory. Well, that's obviously the, the case with this batter. He came into that third at bat after getting his ticket punched twice and was able to get a single. William Contreras comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Center fielder on the run. He gets there, and that's the second out. And that'll bring in Marcelo Zuna. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Smoke toward the hole. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two out hit. He'll hold it second, and there are two aboard now. Boy, so frustrating as a pitcher. You make Your a quality please. pitch on the inside half of the plate the right there. Try to bust an AD row and he fights it off the other way. Yeah, you tip your hat to the pitcher right there. He executed his pitch, but nice job by the offensive player fighting. It doesn't matter what it looks like. A knock's a knock. The Braves have been looking for that big hit pretty much all game. It remains to be seen if they can get it, but now uh, we'll have to leave it there as the play is made for the third. Will Smith enters now in a mop-up role as he'll try to keep the deficit right where it is. And now Albert Pujols working on a good line in this ball game, three for five thus far. On the move is Ozuna. He gets there and makes the play for the first out. The right fielder stepping in for the Cardinals, Dylan Carlson. From the stretch, here's the pitch. To short, hit hard. On to Freeman at first, and there are two away now. The batter. So Number now one. into the box is Ozzy Smith. He Ozzie. reached on a single last time and later wound yeah. up scoring. First pitch of the AB on its way. Hit on the ground to third. Throw on to first, a three pitch inning. And that'll bring in the former top prospect, Ozzy Albies, starting things for his side in the ninth as they face the improbable odds of trying to come back in this one. Yeah, not a lot of hope for them at this point, but these guys know these bats still count, at least for their own stats. You can't mill in your chances as a professional. Hey, that's a heck of a pitch right there. If, he, if he's able to execute with that type of velocity, fastballs up and in, I can't imagine. Not only is he going to break a ton of bats now today, bad. but he's going to open right up that field. down and away with the Guillermo. soft stuff later in the game. Yeah. Guillermo Heredia is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0 and 1. Curveball. Swing and a miss, and he's behind in the count 0 and 2. That was a great hack right there. Timing was on point. Just sometimes you have bad bat barrel accuracy. And that's through for his first base hit in this one. I don't know what side of the fence I fall on, boys. Old school, new school. I think I kind of stand right along that fence. But one thing that gets me jacked up is watching guys grind down an account and drive base hits the other way. Behind 0-2 now. Nothing in two count. And the pitch. Struck him out. Strikeout number 16 thus far as he's had a whale of a ball game. I always like watching pitchers that attack with their fastballs until there's a reason to start mixing it up. He hasn't needed many of the secondary pitches so far on this one, and there was another good fastball for a strike out there. And this is swung on and missed, so now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. Pops this one up, and no one will get this one. And now those that have stuck it out tonight come to their feet. Popped him up. Edmonds has a play. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Yeah, and sometimes you just need a guy to go out there and battle. It doesn't have to be pretty all the time, but just good enough to get the job done. Well, this guy, he was a heck of a lot better.